YouTube family. Fire! What is going on with y'all today, man? It's your boy Jay coming at y'all with a first look video and this first look is gonna have like literally a first look man we gonna throw them joints on feet yes as you see right there a real quick glance of the air jordan one low in the coral colorway man we're gonna talk about some details about the shoe give y'all my first thoughts opinions on them and you know hey give y'all the updated details of when these are supposed to release price and all that good stuff man but before we get into it man if this is your first time rocking out man make sure y'all hit that subscribe button hit that like button for your boy hitting y'all with these early first looks on feats is coming i always gotta tell y'all that just bear with your boy i appreciate y'all for that man but other than that man make sure that y'all are traveling in the right way man i know it's getting hot a lot of traveling is about to go on man get y'all a soul premise bag they are cooking up a lot of stuff over there at soul premise as far as new designs and things man so trust me you do not want to sleep on their bags they do have like luggage roller bags um bags for your daily use bags for your three day four day use man so trust me you do not want to sleep on those bags hit that link down below in the description it will get you a big percentage off of your purchases i think around 40 percent which is a steal man so trust me you do not want to sleep on those hey traveling season is here man and um yeah grab you one of them bags other than that man air jordan one corals is the topic at hand so let's get into it but before we do hold on hold on, hold on. Before we do, let me slow myself down. Um, yesterday was Saturday, so Saturday there was a release of a pair of Air Jordans. Appreciate you. Bang! These right here, man. The Air Jordan 1 Visionaire, which does, as you can kind of see, I don't know, what does that remind y'all of? The box? It is different, unique, you know what I'm saying? But it does have rebellion there vibes you know it does have that that writing all over the box. I don't know if y'all can see it. Y'all can see it right there. Writing all over the box color nike on it and um size tag real quick this ain't about this shoe but air jordan one retro high og color blocking his vote black cell did y'all pick these up these were slick limited man um yeah slick limited you know same type of deal like as the rebellion there you do got like the the same type of writing and stuff on the shoe paper bang here they go right here man so i did pick up a pair uh yesterday shout out to my homie shout out to my homie sherman man sherman hey him and his wife, they looked out for your boy, man. Hey, as always, I appreciate you, homie. Got to give you that shout out because you be looking out for your boy. But, hey, bang, here they go right here, man. Boy, bling, bling, boy. This is a bright shoe. This is what I call a eye catcher. Definitely will catch eyes and turn heads with this shoe. They're going to definitely check them out. Um, Will the attention stay on your shoes and be like those are fire? That's a whole nother uh, question. But they will definitely check out your feet when you have these on. But how long they'll stare at them? I don't know, man. This shoe, in my opinion, is 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 cool. It's not needed. Um, I really didn't need them. I said, hey, let me grab them because I gave up my Vault Gold ones, and I wanted something with a little bit of, of that Vault color. And you know, it's cool. I gotta. I might argue that the Vault Golds look better than these. Um, I haven't thrown these on feet. That's why I gotta give a quick guesstimate opinion on it. But I, I just would just looking at it, I would think the Vault Golds look better than these. But that's just my opinion, man. Let me know. Did y'all pick these up? Were they limited in your area? And um, I do think that this is a limited shoe, but they ain't going for nothing on the resale. But anyways, man, uh, Visionaire Ones, I do have a pair of these. I might throw them on feet, do something in the house real quick, nothing too crazy. But other than that, man, top of your hand. Fire! Let's talk about these Core Ones, man. Yes, sir. Bang! So here we go, man. We got the Air Jordan 1 Corals, which do come in, in a OG style box, man. But a quick hint, you know, if you are buying early pairs, one thing to look out for and notice is that the box of the Coral ones are bigger than your normal Jordan 1 size box, man. So this is a regular Jordan 1 style box. And as you can see, you see the difference? there's that much space they're both even at the end pretty much but there's that much space on the box so it is a bigger size box than usual man i had these in a size 13 and bro when i tell you that that size 13 it looked like a tote like that box was so big bro like you could fit probably two pairs of jordan ones in that box man so do not be alarmed if the box looks huge that is how they should come if you get a regular size air jordan one box in your core ones then you should be worried man so 100 percent retail pair man and on the the note of 100 percent legit um i do see 
sneaker news, I think they had like an article out saying that these shoes are will be releasing in women's. I don't know, man. It must be two sides. You know what I'm saying? Because like I said, 100% legit pair, and it is in men's sizing. So take a look at the size tag. I don't know if y'all can see that real quick. This is a nine and a half that I am showing y'all, but this is a men's size nine and a half. It does not have a W on there, so they will 100% be releasing in men's sizes. I haven't seen any women's pairs, so the women's pairs is up in the L, man, but bang, here they go. First look at the Air Jordan 1 Low in the coral colorway, man. Um, I know y'all see me with multiple pairs right here, man. I do have, at the time of this video, at the time of this video, I do have two pairs left. I do have a nine and a half, and I do have a size 11. At the point of me making this video, if y'all are quick enough, go to JTSG Closet on Instagram. You can get them. Last two sizes from me. I had like a full size run, and when I tell you they flew, because I had them in person at Retro Rick's Sneaker Con event. And when people seen these in person, they just ate them up, man. So shout out to Retro Rick. He had a dope event out there in the A yesterday, man. But yes, man, I'm telling you, when you see these, they're gone. That's why they sold yesterday. But I do have an 11 and a nine and a half left if you want them at JTSG Closet on Instagram. You can email me. My email is down below in the description. But by the time you probably do all that, they'll be gone because Instagram is always my first source to go to. But anyways, man, bang, the Air Jordan 1 Low Corals. Man, this is clean, man. And um, yes, as of recently, we have been seeing a lot of crackled leather. This is nothing different. This still has the crackled leather material on it on all the black parts, except for the swoosh. It does have a smooth swoosh on there, but everything else, like the front part, is all a crackled leather material as well as going up along the lace area man so it does have that crackle material bro look at this man og air jordan one dope 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 like i did say these have the crackle material as well and these have the crackle material as well man so stage haze ones um all these shoes have that cracked leather and stop it stop it just 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 stop it um, I was talking with my homeboy uh, yesterday. I was like, man, why are they going with the cracked look? Like, just curious. How many times have y'all seen a shoe aged to the point where the leather is, is cracked? Like, me and my homeboy was like, I ain't never seen it. I seen a shoe like crumble, like in the back, which is rare, but I haven't seen a shoe old to the point where the leather is cracking. So, Jordan Brand, man, I, I understand, but I don't understand. But anyways, man, these low coral Air Jordan ones, man, take a quick look at them right there on feet. Dope, dope shoes, man. They do come with an extra set of coral pink laces, which I have yet to throw in there, but I will definitely throw those in there when I hit y'all with the full detail review on, on feet of them. Um, just a clean pair of Air Jordan 1 lows, man. Like I said, bro, it's a must cop. Um, I thought about doubling up, man, but I'm kind of, I'm kind of past the doubling up, man, because... I barely get time to wear the shoe one time, let alone have two. Bro, them shoes will probably get old and, and crinkle up on me because I'll never get to wear them because I barely wear my shoes. I have so many shoes. And speaking of so many shoes, man, shoe sale is coming up, man. So if you are a nine, nine and a half, et cetera, JTSG closet, first come, first serve. I might make a video on it, but the shoes will be posted at JTSG closet first. So if you want the heads up, and you want some good deals, man. I mean, Royal Jordan 12s, like some good shoes for a good price. JTSG Closet, man. But yes, man, enough with that talk, man. Let me show y'all these core ones because like I said, first look of these. Um, yeah, man, um, the quality on them too is very good, man. It got some good quality on them for some lows. As you can see, it does have that kind of scrunched up look, man. So it definitely comes with some good quality leather on them. Um, it does have suede on it, man. Some people were complaining saying that they, they wish it didn't have suede. Bro, the suede sets this shoe off, bro. This is a dope shoe. So suede, leather, crinkled leather, more suede on the toe box, white midsole, bro. Jordan Wayne's logo, OG style on the back. Bro, bro, these are fire. These are fire, man. Let me know your thoughts and opinions on the Air Jordan 1 low coral. Um, you know, like I said, it's, it's really like 
a hand in hand shoe with the stage hazes as you know the stage haze did come with a pair of coral paint laces as well which mine's tore off but i do have them in here but they both have you know the coral hits on them you know of course way more dominant on the lows but these are the two like recent Jordans, to, well, not really to release because the Visionaries came out, but you know, these are like kind of hand to hand, coral low, coral high type of deal. But Stage Haze, definitely a dope pair of shoes. Both of these shoes will be releasing on July 2nd. Like I said, I think the date might change because Jordan brand normally doesn't release two shoes on the same day. So something is gonna get pushed back, whether it's the Stage Haze or the Jordan 1 Low Corals. And like I did tell y'all earlier, 100% they'll be releasing in men's sizes. I don't know about women's sizes. So I don't I don't know what Sneaker News knows that I don't know, but I know 100% that men's sizes have hit your retail stores and women's questionable. I don't know about that, but hey, they are landing and touching down at your retail stores, man. So give me your thoughts, first thoughts on the Air Jordan 1. Low coral, these joints is fire, man. But um, that's it for this one, man. Y'all stay blessed. Thank y'all as always for rocking out with your boy JTSG. And other than that, man, y'all stay blessed. Grab y'all soul premise bag. And if y'all want them, size 11, nine and a half, at JTSG Closet. We can work out some numbers, man. But Air Jordan 1, low coral, fire, man. I'm gone. Peace. Bitch, hey, Lonzo, big human go. Human go. Human go. Get it, pronto.